so hey guys and welcome to my channel it's SY here and welcome to another exo zeros video so we have the notice for the upcoming update um, in this update we're gonna have uh, the new episode and we're gonna have the infinity core we're finally gonna uh, have to uh, a chance to take a look at it and it seems like uh, much more important than I thought so I ju just as you can see the dungeon boss will might be different from those that we are seeing now but it's basically the same as embodiment of avarice it's uh, ranked uh, pve you get to battle this boss and you have to try of course to score the highest uh, score there will be of course rewards and uh, the top of the week infinity core ranking will get will get a statue your representative hero is uh, Garf. You're gonna get a statue of Garf if you're on the top of the week of Infinity Core ranking. So they say that uh, you could buy um, Fate Cores. Oh yeah, it's here. So you can buy Fate Core at Infinity Core exclusive store in the next future update. So maybe it's not this one. It might be the one next, maybe next week or maybe somewhere in the future. But we'll for this Yuan's uh, old store we're gonna have we're gonna have the generals uh, I can't see clearly what so the currency is the, the one that you get from uh, Blaine PvP and Embodiment of Avarice but here I can see that you can buy two for 2000 and here five maybe and here 10 but those are those five I, I don't know it's it's not really clear the photos you cannot you cannot zoom in so we're gonna see you uh, it's really good because now you could have a chance to get those generals finally so the hair dye update is going to be here and what else what else a new fate core so the new fate core is going to be a blue Rachel so we talked about this version in the data mining um, video like uh, three weeks ago but we thought that it was gold but uh, it seems like it's uh, blue so this time i'm pretty sure that the only difference is the the skill that deals only 100 uh, percent damage and afflict silence so the one before so it was a lot stronger uh, the multiplier were uh, were higher so now it's 100 percent damage it was uh, 315 315 percent damage and uh, if it kills uh, it resets the turn but now it's only 100 percent damage but it afflicts silence for five turns and after five turns afflict the target with the dance of the red roses that afflict damage equal to 100 percent of own current health this skill is the same i'm pretty sure the same multipliers and the same um, effect so this skill is not uh, changed and uh, the passive is not changed the flow of mana and this hurting and the uh, counter they are the same but this skill is changed and of course since it's a blue fate core um you're gonna uh, get buffs to the heroes that are of the same nation so rachel and shakan and uh, baraka mahar and bernadette forfeited i still don't uh, think that blue fate cores are um, worth the 20 uh, 28 core mileage i don't know if you're a fan of uh, rachel of course you could uh, go for it he is a general so if you don't have if you don't have uh, rachel it's not gonna be that bad and we're gonna have a new hero battle ban we have added some new gimmicks <laughs> i hate the new gimmicks but now with uh, with awakening it's a lot easier actually well not a lot easier but it's doable now the ubers la labyrinth is doable now and uh, something else for this fate core it's gonna come at the first of october so we still have one week and there is no no news on the new banner other than that because the current one that we have uh, is gonna expire today and um, 
yeah the thing is uh, in the door to creation we have a new recipe we can now obtain a nation uh, recruit tickets and uh, die coupons using this new currency which is gonna be uh, obtainable well it's it's not gonna be this week also it's gonna be in two weeks right S the 6th of october defeat uh, golem and totem or through exploration so you could get it uh, from exploration but in two weeks and then you could buy with those maple leaves you could buy die uh, coupons and uh, nation recruit tickets so at least now we have um, a free to play i don't know how how good is this like 100 120 but at least you can get it now free to play uh, you you don't have to pay so that's good now we could get a new ranked um, fit it equ equipment so gloves and uh, and boots and we're gonna uh, get a new abrasive abrasives are used to to increase equipment's experience points so n difficulty modification for season 2 uh, chapter 11 so uh, chapter 11 is undoable for a lot of uh, players but uh, fortunately i i cleared it i did everything i could to clear it to get uh, the fate core ticket which uh, we're gonna take a look at uh, after we finish talking about uh, this update notice so i believe that was uh, everything that is uh, important in this notice so let's uh, go to the game so as I said, uh, it's the same passive, uh, this one is different and this is practically the same. Here it says it's a uh, burst, but I don't know if the other one is also a uh, burst. Yes, it's, it's burst too and it's uh, 5 mana, so the same. So only this skill is changed. So as I said, I finished the story and uh, i got this fate core ticket and uh, let's take a look at what am i gonna get actually that's not bad at all deva is uh, is a very good hero actually she's the one that helped me uh, really to get through this uh, chapter 11 so she was one of my MVPs to get through uh, with Lepin and of course uh, Rhea Arira so I'm pretty happy with it it's better than uh, uh, it could have been a lot worse so as you can see we have now the reversed world and it's gonna expire today in four hours five hours and uh, there is no news about a new banner because uh, the Rachel uh, banner is gonna come uh, f uh, first October so it's uh, next week not today and uh, I don't know I'm thinking of uh, continuing with this uh, banner to see what's gonna happen and yeah I'm already uh, three summons in so why not like I don't think I'm gonna go for Rachel even though I don't have him, but I have a problem with uh, blue fate cores. Uh, they are overrated, I believe. So I believe I'm gonna do summoning on uh, on this uh, gold fate core. It's it's better for me. So I might be wrong, but I'm gonna do it anyway. And I have the zest to to do this and to do an, maybe another uh, core mileage for a gold fate core. If we get lucky, I'm out, of course. If we get Ulum, I'm out. So yeah, let's try our luck.